بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف المرسلين أما بعد many Muslims are confused about which masjid is Masjid Al-Aqsa they have a picture or a painting of the masjid behind me here and I'll say Masjid Al-Aqsa and this is something dangerous because it makes us forget which the real Masjid Al-Aqsa is this masjid behind us is not Masjid Al-Aqsa Masjid Al-Aqsa is the whole compound but the actual masjid is not this one this masjid is called Qubba Al-Sakhra it was built by Abdul Malik ibn Marwan in 72 Hijri this was built on a rock that many of the ulama had felt that this is the place where Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam went for Isra al Mi'raj but it is not Masjid Al-Aqsa in and of itself Masjid Al-Aqsa is on the other side of it this masjid was built by Umar ibn Khattab radiallahu anhu, not in its exact form as it is today, but this location. When Umar ibn Khattab radiallahu anhu came and liberated Al-Quds, he made shura with Ka'ab radiallahu anhu and others where to build the masjid. And he, from what Rasulullah had showed him, he chose this location. The Christians at that time had covered it with garbage and trash to try to hide the original location. But Umar radiyan, who from what Rasulullah had told him, he found the location and he built. This what you're looking at, this is the actual Masjid Al-Aqsa. And the danger of the Muslims not realizing that is, if the Yahud or others try to destroy this Masjid and people are so ignorant, they don't even know which Masjid Al-Aqsa is the real Masjid Al-Aqsa, then people will show them pictures of Qubat Al-Sakhra to say that it's okay while destroying the actual Masjid. This whole compound is blessed. Rasulullah sallallahu said about this place that if you make salah in it, you will get 250 times the reward of regular salah anywhere else. And that's a beautiful fadila. Rasulullah said in my masjid, Masjid Nabi, the reward is a thousand, which is four times the reward in Masjid Al-Aqsa. Masjid Al-Aqsa was the first qibla of the Muslim. This is a very critical location. This is a very holy and blessed location for the Muslims. When was Masjid Al-Aqsa built? It was built 40 years after Masjid Al-Haram in Mecca. Rasulullah Sallallahu in the authentic hadith, when he was asked about this, he said that the first Masjid built was Masjid Al-Haram, which is with Ibrahim Alayhi and Ismail Alayhi Salam. 40 years after that, Yaqub Alayhi Salam, he built Masjid Al-Aqsa. So the, the, so the time between the building of Masjid Al-Haram in Mecca and Masjid Al-Aqsa is 40 years. The original masjid was very small. It was later expanded by Suleiman salam with jinn. And we will show you now the location of the real masjid. So the original masjid al-Aqsa was built underground. This masjid was built later. But if you see here, if you come to masjid al-Aqsa, you'll see masjid al-Aqsa al-Qadim. This is the original masjid that was built by Yaqub salam and then expanded by Suleiman salam with the use of jinn. Actual jinn worked on this masjid as mentioned in the Sahih Hadith. And if you go inside, you will see that the pillars are not just built, they are carved into rock. This whole masjid was carved into a single huge rock, which would be impossible with the, with the technology that was available at the time. This masjid, if you look at this pillar, you'll see that it has been carved out from solid rock with the use of jinn. And this is a very important site for Muslims to know about. And we hope from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives us all the ability to come visit the masjid and to love the masjid. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to free it from the hands of the oppressors and to liberate one more time. Jazakumullahu khairan.